Hi, everyone. How are you doing today? I am Miss Wanda, and I am here with a reading for you. Okay, so this reading is pertaining to someone that has been doing a lot of thinking as well, working on their self, building a stronger foundation for themselves as well. And they're like, I'm creating, creating stability and security. Okay, by providing myself with the basic needs of a healthy life. Okay, such as shelter, food, water, and clothing. I use my creativity to build a strong foundation as this is an essential key to my survival growth. Okay, the more inner and outer stability um, this person has, the more grounded and fulfilling their life will become. Okay, they respect themselves and they take care of their physical body by nurturing and nourishing it okay and it says their body tells them what it needs okay so it's like um also they're they're on a like spiritual awareness as well and it's like when my mind um sways negative um they remind themselves of love truth um and gratitude of uh, and god okay and they are an observer of their thoughts and they do not let them bring them down. All right. And, it, and they says it, re, they remind themselves to have gratitude and acceptance for what is and to have the courage of their convictions. All right. And it's, and they it says they continually pursue a clear, clearer understanding of spiritual truth behind all that is and all that is unfolding okay and they ask themselves um is what i'm thinking the truth and is it having a positive or negative impact on my life so now they're thinking about what's positive and what's um negative in their life okay all right, so um, this person here, there was no balance and there was no peace in this person's life, okay? Yeah, there was no peace, all right? And there was a lot of judging, okay? It was a lot of judgment going on in this person's life. A lot of people have been judging them, okay? And there was no peace, no balance, no harmony, no love, okay? All it was was a lot of negative um energy a lot of negativity a lot of negative thoughts a lot of negative speaking a lot of negative things that they were doing in their life as well okay um they could not release all the negative things that was they was going through and that's why it was no balance and there was no peace because there was a lot of negativity going on in their life okay so they had this spiritual growth they grew spiritually they grew spiritually and they started learning more about God as well, getting closer to God. And they started working on themselves so that they can have peace and balance in their life. Okay? Yeah. Being patient as well. Um, knowing that things happen in God's timing. Okay? Wow. So they are at a place of accepting it as well. All right? And also being honest, patient and being honest, all right? Realizing that they can't always expect the truth from others, but they can expect it from themselves. So it's like they're doing so and they're judging themselves and they are being judged as well. And there is no peace, but realizing that um, things going to change and happen in God's time. And so they're not going to rush. They're going to be patient and wait, okay? But they're going to start being true to themselves, okay? Realizing that other people, you can't trust, you can't rely on other people to be honest but they can rely on themselves to be honest okay understanding that friends is in their life for a reason okay so it's like they are going to start um having empathy for people okay in every is situation that they're facing in their life okay but releasing the control okay so it's like they surrender they surrender to things they surrendering to God, okay? They're releasing the need to control every situation and everything, okay? And they just being patient and waiting on God to do it. They waiting on God's perfect timing and they are surrendering control. They, okay, they're not going to be trying to force things to happen. They're not going to rush into it at all. They're just going to wait on God's timing, okay? 
Wow. They know things are going to change. They're not going to force it. It's going to happen when God says it's going to happen. Okay. Wow. And it's something that this person knows. Oh, yeah. And they know they're going to have an abundance as well. They're going to have more than they have ever had before. Okay. And they realize that they can have whatever it is that they set their mind to. Okay. And make things happen, like focus on it and just work on it. Okay, and they realize that, hey, I can have whatever it is that I set my mind to, whatever it is that I desire. If I put forth the effort in getting it, I will get it. Okay, they will get it. They will receive it. All right. Yeah, building relationships with people that serve them higher good, serve them higher purpose, people that are positive. So, yeah, this person here is building uh, friends around them that are going to be positive. No more negativity. Okay. This person here don't want any more negative people around them. They they clearing themselves of sadness. They end in relationships as well, okay, of negative people. So if this you, kudos to you, okay, because who wants to be around somebody that's negative, okay, all the time, negativity and problems as well, okay, and problems. So this person here is getting rid of all the negative things, okay, looking at things in a different perspective as well. All right. Wow. Knowing that everybody have different challenges in life as well. They trust in themselves and knowing that they're making the right choice and the right decisions for them. Okay. And they putting their trust in God as well. Taking care of their health, honoring their health, nourishing their body, also taking care of their body as well. Okay. This person here is not in denial anymore. It's like they know that they are on the right path and they are seeking happiness. Okay. And this person know that things are going to change for them, going to be better for them. Okay. And they say it's going to happen in God's time. And so they're not going to rush. Okay. They're not going to rush. Okay. Wow. No matter what challenges or obstacles they may face, they say they're going to keep moving forward with things. Okay. All right. Not having any doubt at all, uh, at all. And things are going to work out for them as well. Okay. Wow. So this person here know that there is no greater goal than love and things are going to work out. So this person here is not worried any longer. No more. They gave it to God. Okay. They gave it to God. All right. Mm -hmm. And they don't have no fear. All they're thinking about is love. Okay. That it's like, I got the power within me to free myself, create my own happiness. I don't have to go through what I went through before at all. I finally realized who I am. Okay. And I'm going to go through, I'm, they moving forward if they, with life. Okay. In a positive way, they let go of everything that no longer serves them purpose. Okay. This may be you, but it's like, listen, letting go of everything that no longer serves them purpose. They don't have no fear at all. All right. So yeah, this person here is ready. Okay. And it's like they possess the power and the free will to create their own happiness. And that's what they are doing now, creating their own happiness. They are no longer letting anyone dictate their future, their happiness, tell them what to do and what not to do. Okay, this person here is taking back control of their life, living their life. Okay, living their life like it's golden. Okay, golden, golden, golden. Even when they have negative people around them um, praying on their downfall, wishing on their downfall. Okay, but realize that they are the same as everybody, but with different challenges in their life as well. Okay, so they giving it up. They giving they letting things go, and they giving it to God, baby. Okay, they giving it to God. But they ain't got time for that. It's time for a new day, a new day a new day okay that it is mm -mm -mm. that look like the hospital yeah because things was not working out at one time there was no success and this person wasn't happy wasn't able to live their life wasn't able to have fun wasn't able to enjoy anything at all okay didn't go to god with problems okay wasn't going to God with problems, all right? Wasn't learning what they needed to learn, okay? Look like there was so many problems and things that was going on to where they just wasn't learning from their, uh, learning from that problem, okay? There wasn't learning at all, all right? Wasn't going to God, wasn't enjoying their life, 
Okay, wasn't praying, wasn't meditating, wasn't enjoying their life, wasn't doing anything, wasn't having any fun, wasn't being set, safe. Okay, things was not working out. This person here was sad. There was a lot of failure. There was a lot of negativity. There was a lot of things that was keeping them down, down and depressed as well. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Even in their mind, even in their mind, they was not happy, okay? Even when they had a lot, they just felt like they did not have a lot, okay? Just wasn't a success. Whatever they planned on doing, it just did not work out at all, okay? Wow, this person didn't even have a chance to enjoy their life, okay? Oof. Mm, 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 mm. Thank God for change. Thank God for Jesus. This person here had a spiritual awakening, honey. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Now they're building a stronger foundation. All right? Showing gratitude now. It's like, let me start showing gratitude. Let me start showing people that I am grateful for what I already have. Okay? Being patient and knowing that more is to come. So this person here is being patient. And it's like, okay, so I'm going to continue to be patient and wait because they know that everything they lost is coming back. Okay? It's coming back. Everything this person lost is coming back to them. Okay? And it's like, continue to show gratitude for what you got because what you what you lost is coming back and plus more there's going to be increases in your life and your finances as well okay look like this person here maybe also planning a trip okay but whatever they're doing they're coming up with a strategy and a plan honey mm -mm. they're coming up with a plan and a strategy and they're making some things happen in their life for the better Okay, planning and coming up with a strategy. Okay, there's going to be increase. There's going to be more than enough. Okay, just like I said, everything they lost, they're getting it back. So when there's going to be an increase, there's going to be, they're going to get that back, what was taken from them, and plus more is coming. Okay, and be grateful for what you already have. All right, know that God loves you. Jesus loves you as well. Okay. God loves you and Jesus loves you. This here is something that's turning out really awesome. Okay. A spiritual awakening. All of this had happened. Okay. Now they're building a stronger foundation for themselves, for their life. Okay. Ooh. They're building a stronger foundation for them. Mm-hmm. Yep. So progress is positive. Okay, progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved. Okay, and that's what this person here is focused on the goals. Okay, things are going to work out for them as well, even when it comes down to love. Okay, knowing that all connections knowing that there's love, okay, in every connection. This person here moving forward positive in all areas of their life. So move forward, okay, keep love within you and just keep going, okay? This is somebody that realizes that uh, God is real and all that negativity is going to get them nowhere. So they're choosing to make changes in their life. They're focusing on their goals so they can start seeing progress happening in their life as well, staying positive and moving forward in all areas of their life, okay? And it's like they are open to new possibilities as well okay yes wow so this is all about their life so it's like um uh, go forth okay move forward and have confidence stay strong and stay focused all right because things are going to work out for you that it is okay so have confidence during this time of great joy okay renewal and connections to God, okay, to God. And I, and I pray that you continue to just keep moving forward with things. Don't allow negativity to um, sit inside of you and, and get the best of you. You got to continue to stay positive, okay? Uh, say this video so you can always come back and just know that everything you lost, you're going to get it right back, okay? And plus more. You're just going to have to just keep going. Don't give up. Keep going, knowing that God is with you, okay? Pray, talk to God, get you some friends that, that love God and know who God is um, and talk to them as well, all right? But don't forget about Jesus, okay? Know that God loves you. Jesus loves you. And I love you guys too. All right. So be blessed, you guys.